Good afternoon, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the Command 66 Day Challenge 2.0 Day 54. So before we get involved in today's challenge, and it is an exciting one, I also have some exciting news for all of you. And uh, super excited, like I said, to announce that I have partnered with Lori Ballin, who is an amazing tech trainer. And if you haven't seen any of her videos or are aware of what she does, uh, she is amazing and top of the funnel marketing, um, how to create uh, just a ton of amazing leads in addition to things like affiliate income and YouTube and blogging. Um, just a really amazing person in the marketing space and lead generation space. Has her own Vegas-based uh, real estate team. And so Lori and I are partnering to form the At Your Command Command Coaching Program. And I'll have some information about that in the, uh, the links below. Uh, we are going to have our first live webinar on Tuesday, September 10th. And so I'll post that link if you'd like to join us on that webinar and kind of see what the coaching program is going to be all about. But on to today's challenge. It is finally time to talk about the ability to export contacts from command. I know many of you have been asking for it for a long time. It is now available in limited form um, and we're going to go through and see what that looks like. So um, for example, if I wanted to export everybody that was in my coaching program, maybe the boiler room program. I can do that by filtering for a custom tag. And I have those people tagged as boiler room clients. And I'm going to click on apply. And there's going to be the 10 people that are in my um, kind of higher level coaching program, the boiler room. I could then click on this box right here. It's going to select all 10 of them. And I could select bulk action and then come down as export contacts. Once I do that, it kind of nothing really happens and most people get to this point point, they're like, uh, I don't think anything happened. If you come up to the top and you click on reload or refresh, you can also hit F5. You're gonna see that I now have a notification up here in the top right where my bell is. And if I click on that bell, it says your export contact part has finished. You can download by clicking here. So if I click on that little link there where it says here in blue, it's going to show me down here is the export. Once I open that file, you'll be able to see that here is the Excel document with all of the contact information and um, exactly how the import looks. All of that information exported from command. Now currently the limit is 50 contacts at one time. So I could uh, go back into my regular database here. I could show 50 at once. I could click on this box to check all 50 and then select a bulk action and export contacts. So the export all function is coming. It is definitely something that is being worked on. It's just not available right now. Um, however, you do have the ability to export those contacts out of your database, at least 50 at a time. Same thing with mailing labels. So if you wanted to create mailing labels, you could do that. And again, nothing really happens. We'll do a quick refresh come up to the top here and you can see your export label part has finished click here and when I do so it's going to open up another CSV file and I'll be able to utilize that for mailing labels here so you can see it has name and then address name and address and you can put those into um, you know whatever mail out program you're utilizing for mail labels so that's it guys, uh, exciting announcement and then an exciting challenge, the ability to export up to 50 contacts at one time from your database uh, to utilize for mail outs or you know, whatever else you've got going on that you need to export them for. So again, the export all function is on the roadmap, is being worked on right now, 50 at a time maximum and uh, you can move forward from there. So guys, I hope you'll join Lori and I uh, in our coaching program and on our webinar. And if you have any questions about that, uh, check out the links below. And of course, feel free to reach out to me. Otherwise, it's Friday. I hope you're all planning a fantastic weekend. And as always, I will look forward to speaking with you in the morning. Thanks so much.